Hello, my name is Mr John and I am one of our Year 4 teachers here at Lanner International School. And one of my other roles in school is being the IPC coordinator. So the IPC is the International Primary Curriculum and it's the new curriculum that we have introduced alongside our Cambridge curriculum this year. So the IPC, um, we cover most of our learning in science, and history and geography but also international studies, technology and we cover lots of personal goals such as being uh, curious about our learning, being empathetic with other people as well. So the IPC um, has been a real success so far this year. The children have loved their new studies, their new topics, very very excited about it um, and each unit of the IPC follows a similar structure. So we begin with an entry point which is an activity which is designed to get the children and really, really interested in their learning. So when we did our Temples, Tombs and Treasures activity in year four, which is mainly a, sub a study of ancient Egypt, uh, we turned one of the classrooms into a tomb. Um, and we had the children using battery-powered candles to explore through the tomb, pretending to be Howard Carter, discovering Tutankhamun's um, Tutankhamun's tomb and the remains in there and all the treasures. So that was an activity that got the children really, really enthusiastic about learning about ancient Egypt. We followed that up with something called the Knowledge Harvest. Now the Knowledge Harvest is basically where we find out what the children already know, uh, what questions they have, what they'd like to know as well, and then we as teachers can design our curriculum from there. Uh, following that we do a big idea. So the big idea is where we run through some of the big themes in our topic of learning. So we run through some of the big ideas that the children will be learning about so they know what they're going to be learning and where they're going to be heading. After that we will do a series of what's called research and recording activities. So they will be really hands-on learning uh, where the children can learn through experiences. So at the moment uh, year four is studying electricity so we've been doing lots of things like building circuits. Today uh, my class are going to be building an electromagnet. Uh, we've also looked at magnetism as well so it's really based around exciting learning where the children are not just learning by looking at a presentation on the board they're learning by doing things by discovering things themselves uh, once we've done lots and lots of those exciting activities we have what's called an exit point now the exit point is where the children can celebrate their learning so throughout each unit of the IPC the children are learning knowledge so things that they know facts and information they know skills they're learning new things that they can do and understanding is making the links between their learning. Can they explain what they've done? Can they take it further themselves in a different direction? So towards the end we'll do an exit point which is basically a celebration of everything the children have done in that unit and usually we will try and invite parents in to share that with the children at the moment. It's obviously a little bit difficult but in future parents will be invited in to celebrate that learning with the children. So, so far the IPC has been a real success. The way the, children, uh, the way the teachers plan their IPC, we begin by using something called a root planner. Now the root planner is where we select our year's uh, topics in the IPC and that matches it up against the English national curriculum and it tells us yes we are covering all of the science objectives, yes we're covering our history objectives and etc. So we know that we're covering everything that we need to. Um, the IPC works really well alongside our Cambridge curriculum for maths and English as well so at the moment as I said we're studying electricity in electricity and magnetism in year four. Our book in English, our power of reading book is the Iron Man so we are li making links there so we're going to be making a circuit with a model of the Iron man which has switches and lights for his eyes and things like that. Also today we're going to make an electromagnet um, from the junkyard scene in Iron Man as well. So we like to make everything linked together where it's all possible. So, so far this year uh, the IPC has been a real success with the children. As teachers we feel it's going really, really well as, as well. It's challenging us teachers to have uh, lessons that are more interactive with the children leading the learning as well. So overall a really great start to the first year of our IPC curriculum.